this shit off. You know, this now the camera's all cooked, crooked. I mean, crooked. Well, it's tilted. My side's up. <laughs> viewers welcome back to Butler Family Farm I have got a surprise for you because I was surprised so if I'm surprised you'll be surprised uh, yesterday I came out with some apples to the donkeys they want to try and get the little jack that we're taking to um, Jan at Simply Jam Homestead as soon as my farrier comes out and helps me load it up, load him up on a trailer, then we're going to take him out. And Robert and I were standing over here by this uh, fence trying to feed some apples to um, the donkeys. And he was helping me try to keep um, Pete from being a big uh, apple hog. And Pete's really good about taking the apples. I just happened to glance over my shoulder to this back corner, which you can't see right now because Gunner's in the way, and Abigail was standing back there. And then I looked back there again, and oh my gosh, we have a baby. And she's laying down in the grass with her mama. I was able to figure out that uh, she is a girl, and... Abigail has babies in July, so I shouldn't have been surprised. I just never know when. She's dark, like her daddy, Pete here. Hey, buddy. Pete's a dark one. Whereas last year's baby boy, right there facing Gunner, is um, the gray. But all of Abigail's kids have the black mark on them. You, can't, you can see it really good on him. You can't see it too well on Julia, his sister, stepsister, standing on the other side. But you can see it on Abigail, and you can see it on the baby. Now, I don't know if she'll let me get... I'm trying to do this in the sun. Take the... But Abigail's Maternal instincts are that she's standing over the baby. Number one, it's protection, but number two, it's for uh, the shade. Because earlier in the day, they were over at this tree, and Abigail was standing underneath it, which the shade was in the corral, and I thought, what the heck is going on over there? Well, then I saw this little dark head pop up, so then I knew that she was... Um, protecting the baby. So you want this? Got it? Okay. Hey baby girl. Now see, she's going to kick at these guys. See how she backs up? And that's her, see she just smacked her kid. That's her kid, last year's baby. That's the one that's going to, he was born in June, and he's going to um, Simply Jam, Jan's homestead. Here, I'll give you one more. Because you're a good mama. And I almost have Julia. Here, to sniff. Oh, no, that's the boy, sorry. Julia, here. Julia is a couple years old. Three years old, I think, now, maybe four. She's had 
uh, she's had a couple babies. Last year, the 2022 baby didn't survive, unfortunately. Get back, Pete. Get back. Leave her alone. But she, another sign that Abigail was pregnant is that, and getting close, which I saw, but didn't really pick up on too well. Get out of here is that these two are hanging out whereas before it was the three of them but now it was just the two of them. You want to try a carrot? These are from the garden. I got these today. You want to try it? Stop it. You want to try a carrot, Julia? Abigail. Abigail. Earlier today she had the baby over in those uh, flowery weeds which she, the little girl's not that big tall in this. Here, stop. You want these? I gotta put this on pause. Stop! <coughs> hey, this is... They got up and started moving around. She's got the white nose like her mom. But if you notice over here on the boy, it's sort of a tan. It's not white. Don't be... He's moving on. Don't be kicking at him. But that's the protection. That's the protective nature of this of this mama here. She's always been really good about um, taking care of her babies up to when they can stand on their own. So mom, I'm going to leave you and thank you for letting us take pictures. And you guys, father and son, you can see his marking on his, uh, on his shoulders. And dad's got it too, but it's not as pronounced in the brown. It is over here on the gray. I don't have any more, but he is a pretty Jack Jan. He's a really pretty Jack. Good night, Mama Abigail and little baby girl. Hopefully you'll get your name pretty soon. As always, thanks for watching. Appreciate your support and share out the video if you have a chance.